My name is Andreas Preuninger. I'm product manager within Porsche Motorsport AG, responsible for the GT road going GT cars. Pleasure to present you our ultimate track day weapon, the new GT2 RS. It's the fastest and most powerful street legal Porsche ever built. We have a lot of technology in that car that normally just goes to race cars. And uh, there's so many genes of motorsport in this car because it's developed in, within Porsche Motorsport Department with this one from the same engineers that are doing our race cars like the RS Spider. Wow, there's only one machine faster here than this one and these are the jets above. But um, if you look at it closely, lots of technology coming from the racetrack to the street. So the engine of the GT2 RS is derived from the GT1 Motorsport engine. It has uh, 620 brake horsepower, it has a single mass flywheel, it has special con rods and it has special pistons. It revs up like, uh, like it ex ex explodes, so it's a really very lively turbo engine. It's so much fun and the car is so responsive. It uh, reminds you so much on driving a race car. You have a very direct connection to the car. So there's a dialogue between man and machine that is really, really very special on this car. It's so much fun to drive it. It's, uh, it's almost an addictive sensation. If you look at the car, it, um, it shows you that it's fast. It shows you that it's light. Look at the, uh, at the rims that have a central locking system dele deleting some weight. We have aerodynamics on the car that are um, very much based on downforce. We have uh, Perspex windows on the back. So we try to save weight wherever we can. Even if you look at the badge, the badge is not a, it's not a, a, little, a little plastic or a metallic piece like on all the rest of the, of the Porsches, it's just a sticker. And it's the same sticker that has the GT3 RSR or the RS Spider. So we pay a lot of attention to detail to get the weight down and to get the most driving pleasure out of the car that is possible. I think the competition has to chew hard on the times we're setting with this car on the Nürburgring Nordschleife. We had a record of 7 minutes 18 seconds in totally stock form. The challenge to make a car really go fast is to get all the parameters right. Uh, there's lots of cars out there with six or 700 horsepower, but you can't carry the speed through the corners. The suspension, the gearbox, the tires, all the systems, they have to work properly together to get this performance out of the car. And um, I think this is quite the best and the most remarkable achievement on that car because um, you feel it when you drive it. Everything is in sync. The car feels really makes you part of the car when you drive it. It communicates so directly what is going on on the road and gives the driver so much confidence in the car. And that's always the yeah, this is always the crucial thing. If you have confidence in the car, you can go fast, even if you're not a, ra a race pro driver. Um, but um, I think there's going to be good chances if you drive that thing a lot on track days, you're going to be one one day. <laughs>